All right, back on the south shore again. I have to come here every day, pretty much, because nothing's taken care of in the middle of the island, and it's too damn pressing. Uh, and we're doing a little video. Of course, this is Belmore, but we're going to begin Rockville Center, and I'll show you how well it's doing once again. Wouldn't it be good? Um, that might be the title of this video. I could be on your side. And if you know your 80s music, you should know the lyrics to that song. I mean, you should know the the uh, artist that sings that song. And that is Nick Kershaw. And the song, Wouldn't It Be Good? Um, one of my favorite 80s songs. Here we can see. Full of life, well lit, walkable. When you on a beautiful, bright train station. Only the best for the South Shore. Plenty of salt, too. Like a totally different vibe here. That's Mineola. Yeah, I know. Totally different vibe. It's only for a certain demographic. Beautifully lit up. Civilization, that's where we are. Not a homeless person in sight. Too many people down there. Yes, I have a new phone that I'm filming with, so we're kind of doing that a little bit of a test too tonight with it. My old phone finally broke. The USB jack in it went. And again, there's plenty of life here. It's all taken care of. It's not like it's not like where I live. I don't know if that's optical zoom or not, but it's certainly a big improvement over my other phone. And it does take full HD, too. It's a Samsung. But yeah, my old phone broke it. The, the uh, USB jack finally broken it, and you had no way to charge it. I wanted a new phone anyway. It's not an expensive phone. It's under $100, but... It's pretty good performance, and again, again, you got people over here too. I mean, it's not a ghost town. See, it's it's life down here, you know. But you know, the kind of people that are here, it's all certain demographic. They don't want people like me around to live here, even though this is where I need to live mentally and physically. It would be a lot easier for me to be out here on the South Shore, but you know, that's why I believe I have every legal right to fight to live down here. Obviously, Belmore is not my first choice. I prefer Rockville Center, but honestly, if I found a place in Belmore, I would move here. So everything's taken care of here. This is the place you have to be, you know? We actually have trains coming in a minute or two, so we're going to see... To see what, uh, what we have coming. Some of this video will be with my phone, and then I think uh, I'm going to walk down to the water in Rockville Center. So that I'm going to probably have to use my camera for. Um, but I'm in civilization. 
Let's see if we got see what trains we got here. Still thought, I still would like to stop this thing from like focus hunting, but right, there's two different cameras for this thing. There's wide angle and there's um, there's like the other mode. But I can't zoom and I'm using the extreme wide angle mode, which is what I'm using now. Yeah. There's plenty of life here, you know? Plenty of life. Plenty of life, but it's, you know, all for a certain kind of, certain demographic, you know? I think I like this mode better. Oh, there's an M7. But so when I'm filming, I saw so many M9s the past couple of days. Train still not here yet, so well, it's an M7. Uh, all certain demographic, so white collar people, you know. Yeah, it looks like we're going to have another M7. Oh, well. Of course, when I'm filming, you don't see M7s. What else is new? See, it's just life here. If we're in Mineola, it would be dead. Except for maybe homeless people hanging around. This is where the life is, you know? It's just very depressing when you have mental illness. It's very depressing to be around when I'm around. And people don't understand that. That's why i got to come to the South Shore. Even though these, even though these people don't want me here. Even though they look down on me. It's better than being alone. Anything, anything beats being alone. Alright, so if I do this... Oh, I see that zooms it in. Alright. I guess it's as far as I can go. Oh, I see these different settings. Okay. There we go. Well... No M9, but <laughs> so I saw I had I saw a ton of M9s yesterday. But yeah, I'll be down here tomorrow too. So I'm down here every damn day. So I, this is civilization. Where I live is not it's not civilization. So I have to be here. Beautiful. It's just lit up. It's like it's like it's like civilization. Really is. We are in civilization. I'll admit this station could use a renovation. I'll fill center station. At least a platform area. Yep. It's a beautiful town. Yeah, it's happening in there too. Everybody's having a good time, like I said, they're living it up down here. It's not an exaggeration when I say they're living it up, they really are. <laughs> But you know, you can either be depressed, or you can you can either hang somewhere depressing, or you can go somewhere not depressing. And I'd rather go somewhere not depressing. Constant awesome traffic. Yeah. This is compared to the Mineola, where it's, yeah, during the day there's a lot of traffic, but not at night. Ah. 
Of course, this is where I really want to live. I like Rockville Center. Love Rockville Center. But absolutely no apartments available here. None. Not in the price range I need anyway. I mean, if I could find something that probably would discriminate against me, but you know, I need to live in an environment like this. It's happy, it's uplifting. You know? Just being in a depressing environment. And there's no life. I'd rather be here. You know? Whoops. Sorry. I'm getting used to this fall. Of course, you see the kind of cars that are around. Mercedes. There's a bus coming. I hit the button for the light, it's not changing. <laughs> A reminder what kind of demographic you have over here. Oh, let's go. Uh, there's a bus, there's a 15. Oh, it's kind of like a test here. Let's see how this camera is. Bus gonna make the light. There's so much traffic over here. Nope. <laughs> Didn't make the light. So much traffic over here. It's so happening. This is where the life is, man. That one's just going to Hempstead, it's the 15. So you can see it's probably doing very well in here. Let's take a look and see. Oh yeah, packed. Other bus. Oh, there's another one coming. It's, it's doing well in there. Test and you always see the police here too. Making sure everybody's safe. Making sure there's no swagger walkers around smoking weed or anything like that. You know? So snaps, it's busy. Oh yeah. Let's see. I gotta figure out how to get this thing to zoom. still messing around with this thing, but uh, it's it's happening in there, trust me. <sighs> Gotta be Gillick. You can see it's just traffic here. So happening. Yeah, I got a new Gillig. Twenty fifty seven. Plenty of buses too. Plenty of buses here. So I mean, it's why I like this area. It's happening. It's clean. The transportation is good. It's safe, but no. I have to be stuck in depressing Mineola, even though I need to be somewhere happy and uplifting. That's the problem. That's the problem I face. I, I, I can't take it anymore. 
I know, look, these people are, look, are a certain demographic. They, you know, they have money. They finance professionals. They're preppy. I have nothing in common with them. But it's like the only areas that matter are have these people. You have to be here. Otherwise, you're stuck in the balance. It's so walkable. Look how walkable it is. It's just so walkable. When you have a disability, you need these things that are walkable, you know? It's doing well here. Those restaurants are doing so well. Well, for Mineola, where Mineola would be dead. This is where everybody comes to the cities there. It's just it's a demographic. It's packed in there. See? Just as well. It's where the life is, you know? It's like you either have to be with these people or you be with the problems. That's the choice. That's the choice I have. Chicago. All right, let's, let's not got a copyright. This place back too. It's beautiful here, man. Just wish I could be part of it. I wish these people would just let me in. You know. All right, now I'm using my camera. All right, we are walking We are walking to the water Because I want to take some pictures down by there See these are apartments here. Why can't I live here? You know, these are all apartments Why can't I live here? This would be the perfect place for me to live I mean, why can't I live over here, you know? <sighs> nope, it's for a certain demographic only. And the sad thing is... We'll save the live your own cars. And this would be a great place to... Another bus, another 15. It's more buses on the 15 than there are on the 22 and 24. It's another one over there. I also saw a Gillig that I did not get on tape, but on tape. I mean, it would be great to live here, you know? This is exactly the kind of building I'd like to live in. I mean, nothing, not a fancy building, just something that looks like it's taken care of, you know? No. Not allowed. Look, they don't put up with smokers in here. I guarantee it. See, look at how well lit the streets are, how everything is taken care of here. Again, you see how well just that well taken care of it is here. You know, sidewalks are nice and smooth. Road is decent. Street lighting's good. You know, this is where I need to live. You know. I just wish they'd let me in. 
and then I almost, almost would get on my hands and knees and beg at this point, just so I could not have to deal with the middle of the island anymore. It's beautiful, isn't it? It's a beautiful area to walk around. No smells of weed. When I walk through my area, I'm always smelling weed all the time. You always see people swagger walking in dressed in street clothes. You know, same kind of demographics dealing with dealt with in Westbury. I don't know people don't do that, man. You know I mean, yeah, I have to pick between preppy people or the ghetto. And I, and I know all people say, well, sorry, you're going to go to New Jersey. No. No, I need to live here. It is vital for my survival. Survival. Keep that in mind, all right? When it comes to getting around, when it comes to mental health, all that stuff. They also have their own electric company here in Rockville Center. Now, we do get all our power fed off 33. Three. 33 kilovolt or 34.5 kilovolt feeders from PSCG Long Island, uh, but uh, they have their own electric company here. Looks like they're doing some uh, repairs. They always take good care of their power infrastructure here. Cool. Almost by the water now. Instead, you got some preppy people walking around, but never good to walk around and look at your phone. So, look, I there's the power company, and this is view of the water. I don't know if you can be able to see that, but here you go. Beautiful. Look at that. You got Orion up there. Actually, I think the stars are showing up on the camera. Maybe this camera is sensitive enough to actually pick up some of these stars. I think this is my Canon, though. All right, <laughs> not the phone. <laughs> Imagine all the scenery I could be around here. I know I'm further from the pines, but I can still get there. It's beautiful. I mean, there's something about the water that's beautiful, too. I love both the pines and the water, you know? But we're going to walk a little further because I, I feel like I need to walk some more. We're going to actually walk into... Once we cross over this, we're not going to be in Rockville Center anymore. We're going to be in Lindbrook, I think. I'm not going to walk all the way to Lindbergh, but I'm going to walk back to obviously it's such a nice breeze here too. It's just beautiful, it's so well lit, so taken care of. You know, my whole life I've been fighting to be accepted, I guess you could say. So I get a little emotional about it, you know. But uh, I'm going to be leaving Rockville Sunday shortly. I'll go to that light and then I'll turn around, I think. It's beautiful. All right, yeah, we're entering the incorporated village of East Rockaway, and I would live in East Rockaway, but I run into the same problem. <laughs> Can't, you know, they just keep us out of all the good areas, you know. And yet, we're the ones that actually need it. <laughs> if you have mental illness and depression, you need to be in on happy things, you know, not kept in depressing. Scary things that trigger your depression and anxiety disorder, you know? This is East Rockaway. Whoops. <laughs> yeah, it's beautiful here. That, if you can see it, that's the early can't, but that's one of the 33 KV feeders that serves Rockville Center. All right. Oh, reach, reaching this light. Why did I walk all the way to this light, you may ask? Well, there's a reason. And I don't know if you can see it, but that is a pitch pine over there. Yeah, it's a beauty. Well, there you go. Pine tree and the moon. I think we're going to wrap it up right here. So remember what it's all about. Oh, yeah, you weren't expecting this, were you? Eh, it's all about those great shapes. <laughs>